bastards. Oh, in the car. This, that's what makes me the most upset. This, this, the car, the child seat has glass all in it, and not just like big pieces of glass. It's like fine pieces of glass all in the car seat. <clears throat> Okay, so I called Safe Light. Mm -hmm. and the quote was no, I, I looked at the quote online for Safe Light. It was five eighty for the two windows. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Vortex. Okay. And then I found another company, uh, Auto Glass Now, mm -hmm. and they quoted at first seven eighty five which is like the manufacturer's mm -hmm. price, but they said they do it cheaper than that. And that was for? That was for both windows. This one and this one? Yeah. Because of this? Yeah. Um, and <clears throat> they'll do it for 355 plus tax. Okay. And the total will be 379.52. Okay, awesome. So, yeah. <clears throat> That's uh, handwriting. It's terrible. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so uh, Mason at the repair place said that we need to call back before 2 o'clock to make an appointment if we're going to do it today to drop it off. Sure. So we can call now? Yes. Okay. <clears throat> All right. I appreciate you looking it up and stuff. <laughs> Auto glass now. Now meaning in the next two hours. Yeah, they busy. They real busy. As you can see. So we're gonna sit here and wait. This is the next day. <clears throat> it is 7.39. It is 7.39 a.m. My appointment is at 8. I am already here, and I am sitting in the parking lot. And show y'all I'm not playing. I park right in front of the door. I ain't playing. It's not in the handicap spot, <laughs> but I'm right in front of the door. All right, <clears throat> this is weird. This is the place where it happened. And they got these, got these signs all over the place. And it's like they got it there for a reason. Like they know stuff happens over here. So I'm like, why aren't there like cameras around here? They got these, they got lights. No cameras. Got the glass still on the ground. All on Cascade Road. As you can see, we got our windows fixed. And right now I'm on the way to the car wash. So they, the company vacuumed it out. Auto Glass now is the name of the company. Shout out to them, they did an awesome job. And they did it in like, we only had, we had to wait an hour because it was a long line, long wait. But we had to wait an hour. When they finally got the truck in, it only took 45 minutes to an hour for them to do both windows. All right, we walked across the street, got some coffee, came back, 
waited about 10 more minutes and they were pretty much done that was it so shout out to them auto glass now if you're ever in the atlanta area they're actually in riverdale if you're in the atlanta area you need any type of glass work done on your vehicle what you do is you call them up front tell them what you need uh, if you call before two o'clock they'll have it for you uh as long as you and they, they said as long as you get there by four o'clock they'll take care of you and you, they'll have it done same day so yeah we were done actually before four o'clock we were done they vacuumed it out very well they pretty much got like nine i would say 90 percent of the glass out they got it all out of the doors because you can hear the doors when you close open close the doors you can hear glass just falling and cracking everywhere so they got most of the glass they got all the glass out the doors they got most of the glass off the seats and off the floor but there's still like some little pieces you can still see like little shiny pieces of glass in the in the carpet uh in the floor mats and in the, the baby seat the baby seat is the one we need to vacuum out so we're going to the car wash we're gonna get a cheap little car wash it's supposed to rain tomorrow <laughs> so we're gonna get a cheap little car wash cleaned up for the most part yeah that's not the best <laughs> seatbelt seatbelt alright that's not the best uh, car wash in the world but you know for the intensive purposes that I was trying you know I was trying to vacuum while I'm sitting at the red light let's go over the numbers with y'all I did get both windows fixed uh, the total came to $384.92. So $384.92. Gone. But I'm back on the road. It's all good. Uh, let's see. Both windows. Okay. Both windows were about 90, $97 for the front, $92 for the back, $85 for labor for each window. Is that right? Yep. $85 in labor for each window. Um, the back window was actually factory tinted and i was happy to hear that the, the new window was also factory tinted but the same tint it wasn't it's not factory it's not a factory window but the tint is the factory tint i think it's 20 percent, i believe so i was, I was happy to hear that because i didn't want to ride around with two tinted windows and one that's not it doesn't make sense so i'm happy about that that was that was good to hear that's why I, shout outs to auto glass now they got me back in the game real quick um everything's working as it should i've down kept up putting the windows up and down to make sure they work work pretty well you honestly can't even tell the difference to be honest with you the only thing that's different is the little symbol on the window that tells you uh what company made it the original ones say ford and they say car light ford and car light these say i don't know i can't tell what that says but either way we're back in the game shout out to autoglass now if you're in the atlanta area uh, they're actually located in Riverdale, Riverdale, Georgia. If you're in, any, anywhere in the Atlanta metro area, you need a window, somebody, some idiot broke your window, whatever, or you just need your windows replaced, cracked, whatever, windshields, whatever. They take care of it. Anyway, it's been a rough week, y'all. It's been a rough, rough Christmas holiday for us. Um, a lot of things happen I'm not going to get into, but this was just like another layer on all the other things that have been going on. But nevertheless, we're here, you know, thank God for the blessings that you do have. Don't spend all, all your time, you know, getting frustrated or getting upset or getting mad about the things that go wrong. I mean, it's hard. I mean, it's, it's easy to say that now in hindsight, but I mean, in the moment, you got to, it's, it's, it's something that we, it's hard for us to do as, as people. But 
we have to figure out how to hold on back in the driveway we have to figure out how to focus on our, all our energy on the things that we have the things that make us happy the little things as people say all the little things you know you still got your health you got your family you got a roof over your head you got food on your table and i know it all sounds cliche it always does but it's true focus on the little things focus on the happiness focus on the joy and you won't have space or room to get frustrated when things go wrong even though you saw me get frustrated but you know nevertheless that's what that's what we got to do anyway i don't sit here and ramble all day i'm back at the house um we all cleaned up we're good thank you for watching uh me and car keys uh leave me a comment tell me how you feel tell me what you think when you watch this video tell me if this ever happened to you let me know let me know i want to hear the stories let me know how you dealt with it uh what were the circumstances what was the situation anyway till next time happy new year thank you please subscribe like comment me and car keys appreciate it